of the most popular Broadway shows coming to life on a Coast Community Theater stage this weekend. Tonight, Chet Landry takes us backstage. This weekend, a world-renowned musical throws open the curtains here on the Gulf Coast. I went backstage at the T.S. Hayes Theater at the Lynn Meadows Discovery Center for a sneak peek at Chicago. Paint the town and all that jazz. After 26 years, multiple Tony Awards, Golden Globes, SAG Awards, Academy Awards, and a Grammy, among many others, Chicago is returning to a South Mississippi stage. The musical, a satirical comedy set in Chicago in 1926, is based on a time when the press and the public were fascinated by several high profile cases of women killing their lovers or husbands. But according to co director Cliff Thompson, this version will be different than any you've seen on the Gulf Coast. Chicago is a show that takes place kind of in two worlds at the same time. There's the real life situation that Roxy has committed murder and Roxy is a person who's going to prison and going to on trial. And then while Roxy's in prison and the story's playing out, she envisions herself as a vaudeville star. It was really inspiration we was drawn from the movie because the movie was able to do a cut from Roxy sitting in jail to a vaudeville theater. And on stage, we can't cut, so we had to put the jail and the theater on the same stage. And on that stage, some Coast powerhouse performers portraying larger-than-life characters, like Michaela Kosmeyer, who plays the glamorous yet sociopathic Velma Kelly. This character is so much fun and is so such a showgirl. She does so much dancing, so much singing, and really just kind of is a boss. I get to be that mask of Velma, and so it's I get to be the brash, like, bold version of Velma that she thinks she is in her mind. Kostmeyer's Kelly is the head honcho in a cast of merry murderesses who make themselves well known in the show-stopping cell block tango. <laughs> And in charge of it all at the Cook County Jail is Matron Mama Morton, brought to life by Savannah Myers. On the outside, she's definitely raunchy and very hardcore, but she does really care about her girls, her jail girls, especially Velma. She really does perceive herself as her mama, and she takes care of her. So it's been really fun to play the duality of a role that she is so hard on the outside, but. She's very soft for specific people. Under the direction of Cliff Thompson and Maury Schimper, Chicago promises to continue the unique creativity made famous by John Kander and Fred Ebb and the incomparable Bob Fosse. And after more than two decades around the world and even here on the small stage, this cast of Chicago is, in a word, dazzling. And it was definitely an exciting show, even to watch in rehearsals. And tickets are still available for the show. The web address is there at the bottom of your screen to reserve yours now. Chicago opens tomorrow night and runs this weekend and next.